So today I'm going to be incorporating the rice water into my daughter's hair regimen because I am trying to promote hair growth around her head where she lost a ton of her hair. She was born with quite a bit of hair so um, to see her hair kind of like thin on the sides now is kind of aggravating so I did read that rice water does promote growth and um, it does have a lot of amino acids that are good for regenerating the hair um, as well as using my plant-based conditioner and shampoo that I use for her it's by Hello Bello um, I got it from Walmart it was nothing but I believe like five dollars each for the conditioner in the shampoo and I also have the lotion and lavender and it smells so good it's very moisturizing on her skin but yeah these are the things that I'm going to be using today in her hair I'm just spraying the rice water all over her hair um, because I am going to try to use that to deep condition with the conditioner that I'm going to put in and I'm gonna leave that in for about like three to five minutes and then comb it out with the little detangler thing that I use in the shower and yeah I'm just make sure I evenly distribute all of the rice water and conditioner throughout her hair So bad it had gotten into her eye. My poor baby. But she's a sport. Just to put it down to you. Made me wanna replay all of the things that you and me we do. Look at what you made me wanna do. like without anything in it no product at all and as you can see she's definitely lost a lot of her hair um, around the perimeter of her head definitely the back for sure but it has been growing in a lot since I started using that 100% castor oil that I got off of Amazon I will leave the link down below but yeah it's her curl pattern 
gonna spray a little bit more rice water on her head because I did hear that leaving it on the shaft of the hair is beneficial as well I'm going to be putting her hair in three ponytails today um, I'm going to be using the mimosa hair honey as well as the castor oil for moisture to get her her Elmo book but yeah I'm gonna just let you guys watch me work So I'm done putting her hair in three ponytails. Now I'm just taking like little parts of her hair and swirling it around my finger to give like this little curly effect. All right, and lastly, I'm just gonna put a little bit of castor oil on the perimeter of her head where she's missing all of her hair. So she took the brush for me while I was trying to lay them edges. <sighs> Looks like I won't be able to. Baby, show them the finished look. <laughs> yeah, so today was the first day using the rice water and we're gonna continue to use that because um, her first birthday is coming up and I don't want my baby walking around with no 
hair on the sides of her head or the back but um it has grown significantly so y'all stick on this journey with me to see what it do but before it was no hair at all right here the castor oil, I think it the castor oil does wonders because it's definitely coming back in and she's she's eight months she has her hair is pretty like lengthy um it just has to get that fullness back around her head but yes my baby look good either way right baby you gotta go change her diaper but yep that was my baby's natural hair care routine um she got a bonnet that she wears at night well i need to start putting it on her more but yeah Either that or get her a silk sheet. So, yeah. Um, anything else you want to say, baby? Oh, she's eating edamame. She's teething right now. So, um, I'm just giving her some frozen edamame. She likes it. Her dad didn't think she would like it, but she likes it. I got to show him this video. But that's all, you guys. It's my baby. Say bye, Lizzie.